Hi, in this video I will show how to use desktop application for converting Excel files, Microsoft Excel files, to um, KML files. Um, basically, you can see on the screen I have a Excel application which contains uh, GPS information and it contains time, latitude, longitude, elevation. Time is um, like the same for demonstration purposes. It also contains like different field. You may have a different Excel file, but for uh, uh, the only requirements for Excel file, it, it must contain um, those two fields, latitude and longitude, in, or, in order to render a KML track. Now, um, to in order to convert, to create KML file from uh, this Excel file, I will use a, a, a application from my website. I can close this. Let's close this. My website. I'm leaving on this site into description. To find application, I will click on search and type KML. Click on KML apps and click on Excel to KML and click on the load button to start the loading process. Basically, it will download an um, inst installer on my computer and I will install application from there. I will be recording more videos on KML files and import export KML files and um, if you are interested please consider subscribing to my channel. As you can see archive has been loaded on my computer, I have, a new sh I have it here, I will click on the loaded archive, double click on MSI to start the installation and click on more info here. I am getting the screen from Windows because I am not registered publisher with Microsoft, I will just click, you can see publisher unknown. I just click run anyway to start installation, click on next, next install, click on yes and click on finish on final screen. And you can see application has been installed, I have a new shortcut on my desktop. Now I, let's close this and this and this and double click on shortcut to launch app. Now if you want to have to see example of KML file I will be using, you can just click on this download input file example and it will download Excel file with all those fields on your computer. So you will be able to review it. Um, as I said, the most uh, requirement for for the file that um, it must contain latitude and latitude coordinates, and they must be stored as a text uh, in order to be converted to cam to camel. So um, let me, as as I said, you can download this. Uh, Excel example and add your coordinates into it and just use it for conversion if you'd like to. So um, on first step, uh, we can, you can see we are on step one. On first step, I will select um, my input files. I click on this select input files, my file called my track. Uh, let's see. I sorted it by name. Let's see my track, this one, click on open, click on next step. Um, second step I have to match uh, KML columns to my Excel. You may have a different Excel file and different name of the columns, but on this step we have to match, match KML to Excel. So on my Excel I have latitude column named as uh, latitude. Uh, longitude column name as longitude and uh, altitude I make my uh, as elevation and time is time. So yeah, basically we mapped. We click on next step and the final step. I just click run to start conversion process and it asks me for name and location of the file. This name and location is okay. Just click save and you can see file has been saved. Now let's go on. Uh, my maps google and explore this file so I'll click create new map click on import click on uh, select file from my device sort by date modify to get latest click on import file and you can see it converted my track into into displayed in my track into um uh, Google Maps successfully and I can see all of this uh, also I can I think I can select somehow a uh, different endpoint no not like that i don't know how to do it but exactly in in but um in um, google maps but you can see that it has all start from uh, it has all track from start to finish and all coordinates has been ex exported from excel to kml and uploaded and it's valid kml 
to be displayed on Google Maps. So yeah, basically that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them in comments below. Thank you.